lovelies, this is Stephanie with Chubby Girl in the World and today we're talking about Christmas pajamas and I'm so excited. But before we get started, I do just want to say really quickly um, how I think that Christmas pajamas are just this warm, fuzzy, comforting feeling and I just got off the phone with my parents and they went through just kind of a hard time uh, this weekend and I don't want to get into it but I just wanted I know they're watching and I wanted to let them know how much I love and appreciate them and how grateful I am to them and what amazingly good people they are my parents are the Christmas pajamas of people they're wholesome wonderful everybody wants them everybody loves getting and gifting them and they are they are the warm fuzzy of people um, you can't find nicer people and they've always set an amazing example for me and always been so just moral and courageous and just and I didn't always follow their example as a teenager I was a terrible teenager um, but sorry mom and dad but <laughs> But I know you're watching and I just want to say thank you for everything you do. Thank you for everything you have done and everything you will do in the future. I love you so much and you guys, thank you for being the pajamas of people. Just warm, fuzzy, and wholesome. And without further ado, let's get into it, guys. So I think Christmas pajamas are one of those things that are just so fun to give and to get at the same time. And this round is no exception. There's a lot of really cute things. So as usual, when we talk about clothes, I'm going to be looking down at my iPad, but the uh, picture will be over here somewhere or over here somewhere. I don't know where it's going to be because I haven't done the editing yet. Future Stephanie will do that. So this first one here is from Lane Bryant. It's their Kashyyyk. Is it Kashyyyk or Kashyyyk or I don't I don't know how to say it. It's a weird name. Um, it's just like a it, it's like a weird sleep shirt that just says naughty on the back, and it is I don't know. It's Lane Bryant, so it's probably too expensive. It's probably like forty dollars, but it's it's okay. It's cute. This. One I would rather have, it's called, it says Professional Mistletoe Tester, and it's like in red. That is so cute. I would love, I would love that one. Uh, holiday Drinking Team with the two deers. I'm down. I'm down for that. Even if it's just like drinking apple cider or whatever. It doesn't have to necessarily be alcoholic. Like, I would be on the drinking team. The next one, two, three, four, five ones are from, nope, I'm lying. Uh, yeah five ones are from Torrid and these so Torrid I think has good quality clothes and I all the stuff I've ever purchased from Torrid has lasted a really long time but I feel like they have investment piece prices but they're not things that I would keep for forever so I feel like if I'm going to pay you know 30 40 dollars for something I expect it to last two to three years and that might be a little I, I know like in the era of fast fashion that might be like a little unreasonable but I just am really I I am miserly when it comes to buying clothes because I like so many things but I don't buy everything I like I buy what I need and to fill holes in my closet so keep that in mind when you're looking at this because all of these are really cute but you don't need all of them so just so you know this is a black and red plaid waffle sleep tee. It's really cute. It's got the like little button detail to button up. Um, I wouldn't necessarily buy that for myself, but say you have like um, a friend who's really into like grunge rock and grunge makeup and things like that, and they're not really the cutesy gingerbread kind of people, um, that might be a good option for them. This one is, okay, I'm a sucker for Fair Isle sweaters, and if you don't know what Fair Isle is, it's this kind of pattern here, and this one has little unicorns in the Fair Isle pattern. I want this so bad, but again, this is, this is, I don't want to pay this amount of money for it, so I'm going to have to say the nano to that one, um, so but I might ask my husband for Christmas for that one. Uh, this one I think is super cute. It's a black Santa, uh, ooh, what does that say? Oh, it's a black Santa uh, dog sleep set. So it's like the little 
um, cami top, like a little uh, halter top, and some pants, uh, some sleep pants. And I think that's cute, but I don't think I would pick that up for myself. I think I would pick that up for somebody who was like a really big dog lover. Um, I love dogs. I just don't like, I don't, I wouldn't pick that pattern necessarily. This one, I had such a hard time not buying this. So if you don't know, I'm obsessed with penguins. I love penguins so much. And like when I say I love penguins, I don't mean like, oh, I think penguins are cute. No, I'm obsessed with penguins. I think they're the most adorable thing in the world. My husband got me a birthday card. Um, if you don't know, I turned 34 on December 7th. So I'm even older now. But for my birthday, he got me a card that had two penguins on it. And it was the cutest thing in the world because penguins mate for life. And so I think penguins are adorable. And it wasn't a birthday card, it was a holiday card. And he scratched out holiday and put birthday because he knew I wouldn't care about that and I would like the penguins more, which was absolutely correct. So this sleep shirt has penguins on it and I want it. The only way this could be better is if the penguins had little bow ties. If they had little bow ties, I would have already purchased this. I would have already bought it. This is a Fair Isle Bear sweater and this is super cute. So if you say had a person in your life who was a big like nature lover, somebody who's always watching nature documentaries and who kind of likes that that's their aesthetic or they go camping a lot, like this would be a cute Christmas gift for them. So I think so anyway. So those are all from Torrid's, from the waffle print to the Bear Isle um, ones. I will link to the Torrid, um, I'll link in the description box down below to like the Torrid sleepwear because they're constantly adding product and like stuff is selling out right now. So I don't know what's going to be available by the time this goes up. These next ones though are sleep sets from Simply B and I honestly think these are the best value. Simply B is a brand from the UK but they do have, I think they have facilities here in the US. I don't think they have stores here but I think they do have like warehouses where they keep product um, because when I have ordered I've noticed that I've been getting my orders like a lot faster than I normally did before and I think it's because they used to only be in the UK and I think now they actually have warehouses in the United States that are shipping their product but they don't necessarily have like retail locations so this one is the snow problems uh, sleep set and it's got like uh, black leggings with little white uh, snowflakes on it, which I think is adorable. And that sleep set is only, uh, it's, the, it's the legging set. Yeah, it's the set and it's $15.99 right now um, on simplybe.com, which is, it's under $20 for a sleep set. Like that's, go get that for your friend. Like go get, go buy that if you can. So Joe Brown's gingerbread flannel PJ set. Like this is the traditional like PJ set where you've got like the buttons and stuff. And it's got a gingerbread man print and it's super cute and it's $37.99. Um, yum, yes, yes. This one, if you have a friend who is a ballerina or loves ballerinas or just loves that aesthetic, like that really kind of neutral, blushy, just kind of, uh, windswept aesthetic they might really like this pretty secrets velour legging set it's $34.99 so it's a little bit more expensive than the other ones but I have uh, purchased some of their velour um, like sleep sets before and it's so soft and it's so nice and it actually does hold up in the wash well one pair one set that I do have is probably three or four years old and I need to replace it like it, I'm hard on my clothes but um, you know three or four years and I think I only spent maybe like $20 that's that's a, to me that's a pretty good deal these ones are what are these called I don't know what these are called but they have this really kind of cute sort of it reminds me of like Hawaiian print when I was in high school like every single person had like the green and white Hawaiian print like seat belt like um, not extenders but like the little seatbelt thing to like so the seatbelt doesn't cut into you and then they had the car seat covers and like their steering wheel covers like every single person had that I had that and that's what this reminds me of and it's kind of nostalgic I kind of like it go aughts this one oh, oh my gosh so this is the Olaf holiday legging set 
I love Olaf. I don't care what anyone says. I don't care if I'm basic. I don't care. I don't care. I don't care. I love Olaf. I love Frozen. $37.99. Get this for the Elsa in your life. So me. Get get that for me. Cause just I'm I'm trying so hard not to break out and to let it go. Cause I'm just gonna let it go. Let it go. Okay, I'm not gonna I'm not gonna sing. Sorry. Sorry if I hurt your ears. Um this one is also another set for 21 20 I'm sorry 29.99 and it says barely awake and I love the colors because it's like a lavender and a blue it's like a cool tone one so it's not it's wintry but not Christmassy so maybe if you had a friend who didn't celebrate Christmas but you still wanted to get them something um or make a good Hanukkah gift or a good um do people give Kwanzaa gifts I don't know I really need to look that up like it's it's nobody's job to teach me like I need to go look it up if you do happen to know, please leave it down in the comments down below. Please correct me. And I'm sorry that you have to teach this light skinned person what Kwanzaa is. I'm sorry. Um, but these are Chanel booties for $21.99. And I think this also goes to like that kind of ballerina aesthetic where you're warm and cozy, but you're still cute. Like this is if me and my husband were still dating, these would be the like slippers I wore when he came over to like hang out and watch Netflix and stuff. Um, these would be the super cute ones. Like these are the cute ones that you bring out when you're gonna wear your cute like hoodie and you're gonna like kind of hang out with people um, instead of like your raggedy ones that you just wear around the house. This is a 2Z with a gingerbread man 2Z for $27.99, also from simplybee.com. All of these are from simplybee.com. I like that one. I think it's just a little meh, basic, but whatever. These Santa slippers though. Um, they're Santa mule slippers for $15.99. And I, I need these in my life. Um, I would wear them year round because that's just the kind of person I am. I just, I would. If you're that kind of person, hit that like button, hit that subscribe button. We can be friends. If you're not, do, do, do that anyway. So you know how YouTube works. This is another bear one. There's a lot of like bear themes. Um, Pretty Secrets bear legging pajamas for $40.99. This one has like the 3D, like the 3D bear poking out. And I think that it's cute. But I don't know that you would necessarily want this if you had small children because they might like tug on it and the print on the leggings that was like that's the print on the pajama pants is adorable. So also from Simply Bee, these are Pretty Secrets button through pajamas. Um, this would be a really good Hanukkah present because they just have the like the stars and it's blue and white and it would be a really nice gift again for someone who maybe doesn't celebrate Christmas or maybe they're just not into Christmas colors like a lot of people just aren't into Christmas colors that's not me I'm wearing shiny red eyeshadow right now from the Christmas morning palette from uh, Give Me Glow Cosmetics I have just been loving this palette all week I've been doing so many different looks with it um, from neutral to festive to today I did kind of like a sultry look with red the red shimmer and I, I love the Christmas aesthetic, but not everybody is into that. Some people are more into like a more editorial, you know, Christmas. They're into a winter aesthetic, not necessarily a Christmas aesthetic. So that would be for them. The, oh my God. <laughs> okay. I don't, I cannot tell you, I can't tell you how badly I want this. This is a two sets so you get two sets sleeping sets for oh my gosh I can't I don't remember it'll be it'll I'll link down uh to this specific uh twins set below because one of them says lit and then the other one says slaying it and it's Santa with a champagne glass it's I don't this is life goals like I am gonna be I want to be sitting on my couch watching it's a wonderful life with champagne in one hand wearing this Santa's wearing sunglasses and slaying it I love it I love it I want it this next one if you have a Khaleesi fan in your life let them be the mother of dragons with the dragon novelty slippers 
So these ones are $23.99. I think they're cute. They're not necessarily for me because I don't necessarily like like big giant heads on the ends of my slippers, but I think it would be really fun for like a Game of Thrones fan. Oh, and I don't know if I said this at the beginning, but like this is not a sponsored video at all by any of these companies. I just scoured the internet looking for Christmas pajamas that I love, and I love Christmas pajamas, so I'm really excited about them. That is it. The next thing we have is a Pretty Secrets Bear onesie, and it is an all white onesie with little bear ears and pom poms. How can you get any cuter? How? How? It's impossible. It's impossible. Um, these next ones are from Avenue. So I, I normally, I normally don't check for Avenue, to be honest. Um, I, on purpose, went to their website to see, because around the holidays, there are some websites and some companies that I go to, uh, go to, uh, oh my god, you guys, you didn't tell me I had like lipstick in the corners of my mouth. Um, it's because I'm running my mouth so much. Um, so I normally don't check for Avenue. Like I'm not checking for them. Uh, they're just, they're trying really hard to kind of appeal to a younger demographic, but I feel like it's still a watered down version of what I would want it to be. Like I, Avenue has this, a, this really safe aesthetic and I feel like they have wrap dresses in what they think are good prints, but they're really just like not flattering or they're just kind of, they got old grandma vibes and I just, that's not what I'm looking for. I'm not, I'm not looking for that. I'm looking for something that makes me look sharp and makes me feel empowered and makes me feel just like, I want to look, I want to have the same options as a size six person does. With that being said, they did have a couple of plush robes that looked pretty cute um, and they were really affordable. So this one is the heart print plush robe. It's in blue and the hearts are white and it's only $22 marked down from 55. So I think that's a pretty good deal. If you have someone in your life who like loves luxury, loves doing facial masks and things like that, this would be a really good gift for them to keep warm while they were doing that. Um, they also have that same plush robe, $22, in a pink dot plush robe. So it's black with pink dots. And I think that's cute too. Um, the So those are really the only two things I saw for like Christmas sleepwear that would be good gifts or that I thought would look cute. Everything else just sort of, there were sleep shirts and like, I don't really like sleep shirts unless they have penguins on them. I'll make the exception for that, but nothing else. Because I I want pants. I want pants or leggings or something else. I just, I don't want a sleep shirt. That's my preference though. You might be totally different. This from Target though is a llama onesie. <laughs> like, I, I, I don't, I don't know how I feel about this. Like part of me saw it and was like, yes. And then the other part of me saw it and was like, oh no, what are you doing? But I feel like the yes part of me would win because I love whimsical, fun things. I mean, obviously I wouldn't go to the grocery store like this. Okay, I, I wouldn't go to the grocery store like this if I was sober, we'll put it that way. Um, but it is cute and it is available at Target. So I will, um, again, I'll link to, I will link to all of the, um, the sleepwear like categories of these brands where you can go through and see. Cause like I said, they're always adding stuff and some stuff is selling out. So there's no guarantee that by the time you see this tomorrow, it'll be there, which is kind of sad. Um, this is Old Navy though. And usually Old Navy is pretty good about keeping this stuff in stock. Um, I think both of these patterns are available in the plus and straight sizes. There was a lot fewer patterns available in plus sizes than in the straight sizes, which really kind of always upsets me. It's like, you know, Old Navy, I, just because I'm plus size doesn't mean I don't want to wear graphic tees, doesn't mean I don't want to wear, you know, all of the cool, fun stuff that's coming out too. And it's like, it's really upsetting because they're supposed to be an affordable brand and it's like they're only it's like I only have access to half your line and like that upsets me this is pretty cute though it is the uh, ginger it looks like a gingerbread and um, 
It looks like it looks like a like a National Lampoon inspired print, and I love that movie. I think it's so much fun. Um, it is. It was thirty seven ninety nine, marked down to twenty dollars now. So that would be a nice gift too. They have the same kind of set, but it's in like a dog sledding and or a dog uh, skiing. Like the dogs are on skis, and that's the print. Um, they have again that one is twenty dollars, and I think that those are affordable. But again, there's so many other choices and straight sizes, and so I'm kind of like, like what is going on with Old Navy? Like. First they had plus sizes in stores, then they took them away. Now they're only rolling out plus sizes to some stores, but you can't get a list of like what stores have plus sizes in them. And that's really upsetting because they're like, oh, it's only like 75 stores. Like, well, which ones? Are there any near me? And when you go to like, I, I actually called all the Old Navies in my area and they're like, no, none of us are getting them. I'm like, okay, well, do you know who might get them? Like. Because I don't live that far from Washington State, so I would go to Washington State if I had to. But nobody, like, had that information. I'm like, what is going on here? So, a little upset at Old Navy. I'm a little salty about it. So, now, my last, uh, my last pick of the day is Charlotte Roos. Charlotte Roos has $5 leggings right now. And these are like a fair idol print with uh, looks like poinsettias and snowflakes and they're so cute. I never I've never ordered or worn anything from uh, Charlotte Russe as far as leggings go. I went on and tried their um, their jackets and their jackets seemed pretty well stitched together well made quality their jeans seemed pretty good. But I haven't ever tried out their leggings so I might put in an order for this and see about getting some $5 leggings because I would wear these all winter because they're not necessarily Christmassy, but they're wintry. Excuse me. So they're Christmassy, but not necessarily wintry. And I think that they would be a really good addition to any winter wardrobe because you could probably wear them like under jeans, you could wear them under a skirt so that that's I, I'm always trying to find ways is like how do I use my summer clothes in winter and how because it's kind of harder to go the other way using your winter clothes in summer but it's a lot easier to use like a a dress in like a summer dress in winter if you can layer if you can layer on jeans and other stuff like that so I think that that's a really important thing to consider when you are buying things like for summer and for winter like what in your collection like what in your closet is this going to pair with what is it going to complement because you don't want to buy things just to buy them you want to curate your collection you want to make sure that you're doing everything you can to have the most amount of value and the most amount of use with the least amount of products because having a ton of clothes seems like a good idea until you have to move Trust me. So I'm actually going to be doing a huge closet declutter um, at the end of this series. So stay tuned for that, and um, it'll probably be on. It'll probably go up on the 24th, so on Christmas Eve, where you know everyone else is going to be running around and talking about last minute gifts and stuff like that. I don't do that. I do my Christmas shopping in July, so don't. I don't. I don't worry about that, and you should too, because everything's on sale. Um, but just, like I said, just think about your collection, the holes that you're going to fill in it. And if you're gifting, you might want to ask, you know, make, do some discovery questions about someone and be like, Hey, have you seen X amount of leggings or have you seen these fair aisle things? And if the person's like, Oh, I hate fair aisle patterns, then you know, not to get them a fair aisle pattern, you know, pajama set. But for the most part, I think because pajamas are something we don't wear in public, we're a little bit more adventurous about the patterns and colors that we wear. So thank you so much lovelies for sticking with me through this really long video. And thank you so much again to my folks who I wouldn't be, I, I wouldn't have the life that I do without them. Outside of YouTube, I have a really whole and fulfilling life, a wonderful marriage, a great career. And I love doing this with you guys because it's so fun to talk to you about fashion. I love being able to talk to you um, 
all the, I, I've met a couple of new people online who just love talking and love interacting. And I love doing that with you guys. So please, please don't be afraid to comment down below or let me know what you think or if you think I missed the mark or let us, in the comments down below, let us know if you, there are some pajama sets that I missed that you think are awesome because I'd love to know about them. Thanks so much lovelies and have a fantastic day. Bye.